I grew up in an environment where music was the thing. And I started playing drums, and then I learned how to play guitar, and then I learned how to play uh, keyboards. By the time I was 17, I, was, I started to tour with the band and we recorded CDs. I came out on uh, national TV, uh, Mexican stations, and then being in the environment of music all the time. You know, free beer, you know. But then from beer, it, it went to drugs. I still needed um, something else, you know, that I wasn't finding that satisfaction in what I most love to do. You know, you would think, well, I'm doing what I love to do. I'm good, you know, I don't need anything. But I was actually very, very empty. Uh, I met a, a friend, you know, through one of the bands. One day he just disappeared, and I was like, whatever happened to him? So I was like, well, whatever, I'm gonna just keep on going, do what I do. A year later, he comes back into my life, and I remember he, he called me, and I remember that, that he told me, hey, Joe, how you doing? And I'm like, oh, I'm good, you know, how you been? Where you been? He's like, you know what? I, I I've recommitted my life to Jesus and I'm going to church and I want you to come with me. Uh, but I felt there was something already working in my heart. So I was like, sure, let's go. So went to church for the first time in my life, like there was light that came into my heart. And finally, you know, I had an encounter in that Christ was asking me to leave everything and follow him. I had to leave what I most loved, but to obtain something even greater, far greater. And, and sure enough, I left the band um, God delivered me from drugs, you know, I was, I had a, a cocaine habit, you know, I was involved with marijuana, um, LSD, and so many other drugs, and instantly God, like, delivered me. And coming to Christ, I was like, Lord, where does, where does that, that God-given talent, how does that come to play? And sure enough, walking into church for the first time, I see a band, you know, worshiping God, and I see a keyboard player, a guitarist, and, and all these different in instruments and vocalists, and I'm like, wow, God, like, this is why you gave me the gift. And now today I find myself as a music director in the Spanish ministry, and I'm married now. Um, I have uh, four beautiful children, and it's the best decision I've ever made in my life.